Okay, so it's the tough table challenge. Uh, I still top the lead with 82. Getting quite disappointed in these top players. They're not performing as I would expect. So Sean, no pressure. I mean, that's remarkable, isn't it? It was, uh, it's amazing. I surprised myself, actually. You've surprised me. Do you know what I did as well? Because I ended up down here and I potted this red in there to keep the break going. Did you? Yeah. Because it was on a rasson, wasn't it? Yeah, well, let's not go there. Okay. Anyway, so tough right. table challenge, okay. ball in hand. Any other rules I should know? No rules at all. Okay. One. I've gone nervous all of a sudden. <laughs> I mean, if you had this opportunity to match, would you be thinking, well, oh, might score 50 or something? You wouldn't be thinking frame chance, would you? 50 at best. <laughs> Eight. Nine. Are you already thinking about cannons? Yeah, no, there's a, cannon, there's, a, there's a cannon coming in two shots. Okay. I just like the idea of playing the cannon to these three next, whilst this is the reserve. That's exactly what, that was my, my um, reasoning as well. Of course, you do have to pot the red. Okay. 16. Well played. <laughs> Take two. I suppose it does help if you can see the pocket, doesn't it? That does help. Oh, here we That's go. My professional here we go. <laughs> as JB used to say, put as many balls as you can. Right. Okay. One. Eight. I think there is a pocket in there somewhere. Yeah, the lighting's not great. I will, I will give you that. Nine. Two reds, two blacks. Two reds, two blacks. You've gone early. <laughs> Sixteen. Roger, you put the reds and blacks there. <laughs> now leave a nice angle on this black. 17. To play the cannon to the three. Red yeah. in the middle is the reserve if it goes wrong. Yeah, so you don't want to catch his full ball, do you? No, I want to catch this red like half there. Just yeah. graze it. There was no grazing there, but he's may have got away with it. Oh, goodness. Is that official butchery? That was, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, you, that was you, butchered. You would be getting a little bit of criticism from me in the box for that A shot. little bit of criticism. Yes. Goodness me. I mean, that's gone, that's almost break over. You know what I, I would say about that? Clumsy. Clumsy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you not get this with a flick aside? No, no, well, I, Pink's not on its spot properly, I will say that. Not if we're playing by the rules. Pink is not on its spot properly. No, I can't, I can't turn that in. Oh, so see the yellow pocket, or it's red to the middle. You can't turn that, oh no, you're not giving me the colour anyway if you do turn it in. Right, red over into the middle. This is tricky. This is tricky, isn't it? Sean Murphy, you've just gone level with Mark Williams with 24. Very, very poor. I'm disappointed in myself. I brought shame to my family. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's time for 10 quick questions. Uh, I'd always like to thank my followers on Instagram for help with these. I put a couple in myself, but really appreciate all your input. So 10 quick questions to Sean Murphy. Favorite song on the piano? Uh, favourite song, yeah, no, I, I, I like to have a bit of time on the piano in the mornings, take the kids to school or whatever and come back, have a coffee on the piano. I usually end up with anything like Elton John or Billy Joel, something like that. I like a bit of Elton John, that Border song or okay. something like that. From a mutual friend of ours, Matt Sell, does he genuinely think he's a scratch golfer? <laughs> 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 I played golf with a friend of mine, uh, he said, um, you're the worst scratch golfer I've ever seen. Um, well Matt, I'm not a scratch golfer anymore, I've gone up to two. <laughs> Would you rather play an out of form top 32 player or an in form 33 and below player? Yeah, I think the gap between the top and bottom has got so much smaller over recent seasons, I'd much rather play someone who's out of form regardless of where they're ranked. Uh, so I'll take the out of form top 32 player. Okay. Who's your most difficult opponent? Uh, well, the cliche answer is myself, isn't it? You know, because we're all playing against each yeah. ourselves. Uh, and if I get my head space in the right place on any given day, I can play well. But I think, you know, um, when, I, when I joined the tour, it was you. And I think in modern day history, it's, it's been Ronnie O'Sullivan. Okay. Would you take in a season 
one world title or three ranking titles? One world title, without question. Good answer. Strictly Come Dancing or Celebrity in the Jungle? Oh. It's not called that. I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. <laughs> celebrity in the Jungle, That's a new, that should be a new <laughs> That's show. That's a new show. Yeah, We're just a, a new yeah. show. They should call it that, it's much better. Um, Strictly or Jungle? Strictly or Jungle. Um, I, mean, I don't know why I'm hesitating. Without question, it's Strictly Come Dancing. Yeah, in a heartbeat. <laughs> I'd do it for free. I wouldn't do it for free, that's a lie. <laughs> Favourite magician? Favourite magician? Uh, well, I'm very lucky. Don't say, you can't say you uh, again. No, I won't say myself. <laughs> uh, I'm very lucky that one of my best mates is one of the best magicians, certainly in the UK. He's been on Britain's Got Talent and all sorts. Oh, okay. He's phenomenal. Uh, David Penn is his name. David and Penn. He is a joke. He's not Penn and Teller. He's not one half of Penn and Teller, no. <laughs> but he is ridiculous. Right. Ridiculously good. Favourite food? Uh, Chinese. Favourite golf course? Oof. Uh, I'd have to say Adair Manor in, okay. in Ireland. Favourite ever shot? Favourite ever. That's, a diff that's difficult to think of, put you on the spot yeah, and that's, think of that. That's very hard. Um, uh, but thankfully, uh, easy to answer. I played a shot against Ronnie in the Worlds that went viral. It was a sort of semi-trick oh, shot. Oh, the two cushion were checked. the two cushions. It's actually, it was three cushions in the end with the check, clip the red in over the middle pocket. Uh, that was played for and got. Often those shots aren't actually what you're trying yeah. to do. I did try and do that one. Um, but I suppose the sweetest shot that I still remember was the red to the number two pocket that won me the world title in 2005. Beautiful. Sean Murphy, been an absolute pleasure to spend time with you. Thank you. you too. All the best for the Cheers. season. Appreciate it.